At Johns Hopkins Medicine, our quest to prevent and treat disease begins with world-class research. This year yielded fascinating new insights into the nature of life, from interactions between crucial proteins to clinical tests of promising new drugs. Here are a few highlights. Johns Hopkins researchers unveiled the proteome, a massive database detailing 80% of the proteins in our bodies. While genes give the instructions for life, proteins are the foot soldiers that carry out their commands. The proteome will speed progress in nearly every biomedical field. Did you know that some fruit flies are insomniacs? Studying such sleep-deprived flies, scientists identified a gene that promotes sleep early in the night and regulates sleep cycles. If confirmed in humans, the research could lead to more shut-eye for those with insomnia. The human immune system has legions of highly trained sentinels that guard against invasion. But every now and then, a bad guy like cancer slips through. To catch these rogue elements, researchers programmed ordinary cells to gobble up problematic neighbors. It's a step towards custom designing immune cells to disarm cancer and mop up other junk. In another bid to boost the body's defenses against cancer, researchers injected tumors with specialized bacteria. This launched a vigorous, precisely targeted offensive against cancer cells and dramatically shrank the tumors. People with heart attacks often experience abnormal heart rhythms during resuscitation. Using cardiac cells to create heart attacks in a dish, Johns Hopkins researchers found that often fatal rhythms stem from something akin to power grid failure that causes the cells to misfire, a complication they were able to avert by pretreating the cells with a sedative. In a step to restore lost vision, researchers use stem cells to create miniature 3D retinas in a dish. The lab-grown retinas behave like normal healthy retinas, fueling hope for new therapies for eye disease. Using stem cells with a genetic variation linked to schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, and severe depression, researchers found the variation disrupts connections between the neurons in the developing brain. The results suggest many mental illnesses can be traced to faulty brain wiring during early development. Could glitches in the way cells process energy be a culprit in autism and related disorders? In one recent study, autistic mice improved when fed a man-made oil. In another, autistic young men fared better while taking a chemical derived from broccoli sprouts. Both treatments seem to alter cells' metabolism. The timing of a cancer diagnosis can be the difference between life and death. Soon, a simple blood test may detect early-stage cancers by sniffing out bits of DNA in the bloodstream. This liquid biopsy could also monitor response to treatment and predict which cancers will defy therapy. What if people with arthritis could simply take an oil can to their aching joints? Researchers discovered a joint coating molecule that, when injected with lubricant, could ease arthritis pain and keep artificial joints working smoothly. As we move into 2015, we look forward to building on these discoveries. Come back often to see the latest steps we've taken on our journey to transform medicine and improve human health.